What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. And if you're new, welcome to the channel. All right, we're going to be taking a look at the Boulevard set. This here is wave number two. This will be six through ten. cases had to get another case so as you see uh oh i think this one is disconnected at the bottom yep yes it is hmm. okie dokie let me fix this real quick and I can't get this one to be fixed. Hold on a second, guys. There we go. Got it. All right. So I had to get a new case. If you guys wonder, if you guys want this case, um, down in my in description box below, you find a link. You can order you some. This here is the model 5324 from Plano. Store and go. 24 compartments. I'm not sure what the price is going right now. If it, it fluctuates up and down from time to time but yep we're going to be taking a look at the second wave so you know what i got it sitting right here anyway best thing to do i think i'm gonna keep all the boulevards together so yeah we're gonna do that take it out of here and put it in there so this is wave one put that back in there you guys that way they all stay together Yep, that's a little better. All right, so let's take a look at wave number two. Up first, we got the Porsche 356 Outlaw. I was never really a, I show you guys, I was never really a fan of this, of this model. It really wasn't. Let me scroll down. Yeah, I was never really a fan of this model. I don't know. But just seeing it, it just reminds me of Top Gun. This was the uh, flight school instructor, the female. She had one of these when she chased him down, ran through the light, almost got into a wreck. When she said, I'm falling for you. <laughs> yeah, that's my movie, guys. All right, so that's number one. We're going to put it up there. Boo. All right, up next, we got the Sylvia. Ooh-wee. I can never get these things open. All right, here you go. Drift formula. Formula drift. It's not that bad. I like it. I like how I go from red to blue. Same thing with the wheels. Ooh, that don't sound good. You guys hear that? That's this front wheel. Oh, look. Can y'all see that? Imperfection in the rubber. I found a corporate. See that? Peel that off. See if it changes anything. All right, let's check that out. A little bit better but there is number two guys Ooh, this, I know this is a boring video like I said I'm just taking a look at them 
Well, that's number seven of ten. This here's number eight of ten. Take a look. Oh, that one open up real easy. It might be okay. It might do okay on the track. I doubt it. It probably won't even make it to the end. Just because of the wheels. See how they tucked in? And they real close together. Look, this is barely, it's rubbing now. But there you go. All right, let's have and get through this video. Up next is this one, number nine. Number nine of 10. This one might do some good, but this might drag on the track on the transition. So we don't know, we have to wait and see, but yeah, yeah, king of the real riders, guys. I'm gonna be starting that up soon. Probably after this video is up, I'll probably start it up. And last is, look, this is coming open. But it's all right, cause I got two of these. Number 10 of 10. Ooh, this is nice. Let me see. Yes, it will hold the track. So here's the second one of it. First it was the red. Now it's the white, black, and red. Beautiful. Beautiful. All right, guys. That is all of them. So... Which one do I think is the best out of the out of this set? And I know some of y'all gonna won't agree with me on this, but honestly, I gotta go with the Camaro. Gotta go with the Copo Camaro, you guys. I think this one is the best out of the set. I know some of you gonna disagree, but it's understandable. That's what I like. So that's that. All right, guys, be safe out there. Make sure you keep your distance, wash your hands, and don't go out unless you have to. All right, guys, this is Howard Racer Mike, and as always, I will catch you on the next one.